builds. The Charlotte Motor Speedway has made a few more announcements, including another celebrity grand marshal. NBC Charlotte's Rob Hughes was out there. He's got our story all new at 530 for you. Yeah, guys, a lot going on here at Charlotte Motor Speedway earlier this morning. Military service, men and women in attendance, appropriate since their presence is always felt here on Memorial Day weekend at the track. The news, though, Channing Tatum, the Hollywood star, will be the Grand Marshal for the Coca-Cola 600, a popular choice among the female crowd, even if it's not for NASCAR driver Matt Kenseth. All I know is my uh, my 65 year old babysitter said that she likes this magic mic thing. So I just looked up and I, I think he was a male stripper. And I was like, that's kind of weird, Bonnie. <laughs> Tatum is just a small part of the pre-race ceremony. There are plans for an impressive patriotic salute to armed forces around the world. Brought to race fans by 600 of Fort Bragg's finest. It's a great honor for us to come out here, uh, display you know, a small portion of our capability. Uh, to one of the most loyal fan bases in America. With a lot of powerful ammunition at their disposal, Chief Williams says the artillery pieces are their bread and butter. They're really loud. NASCAR's a really loud sport. The fans really eat that stuff up. For the Fort Bragg service members, their day at the track ended with a ride along in the pace car, driven by Matt Kenseth. The NASCAR Monster Energy Series returns Sunday at Kansas Speedway before coming back home to Charlotte for two straight weeks for the All-Star Race and the Coca-Cola 600. At Charlotte Motor Speedway, Rob Hughes, NBC Charlotte. I really do appreciate life. My story is just beginning. Coming up all new at 530, overcoming the...